Sam is also hiring. According to multiple reports, the IRS wants to hire 10,000 workers. The hiring rush is to deal with a backlog of returns. The IRS has still not caught up from last year's filing season. In fact, the agency currently has at least 10 million individual returns and 4 million business returns. The IRS have 20 million unprocessed returns, many from previous years. Well, they are planning on hiring 10,000 workers to help clear up the backlog. The IRS plan to hire 10,000 workers to tackle a massive backlog of more than 20 million unprocessed returns, including filings from previous years. They hope to fill 5,000 open positions in the coming months and another 5,000 new hires over the next year to ensure inventory is back to a healthy level for next filing season. We are leaving no stone unturned, taking an all hands on deck approach to ensure as many employees as possible are dedicating time to return processing. IRS Commissioner Chuck Retting, this is what he said in a statement. This includes bringing on new employees and reassigning current IRS employees to process inventory, he said. However, the hiring spree may not provide a boost to the current filing season, according to the national taxpayer advocate, Aaron Collins. If you hire someone tomorrow, maybe by summer, they'll be up and operational. She said they have to go through 12 weeks of training just for the basics. Still, the influx of new employees may help beyond April 18th tax deadline as many Americans file for extensions. Mm -mm -mm. Well, yeah, uh, you know, I, I've heard from several people that told me they never even got their return from the previous year and they're still waiting for it. And I think that's a disgrace. You even got an agency like this that runs so poorly and it has never improved, but they sure won't hesitate to come after you, but they sit there and run everything very poorly. But y'all let me know what you think about this. You know, they plan on hiring 10,000, five, hopefully this year, and another five going into next year. You know, and, you know, they're still on that facial recognition stuff. And I'm telling you, that stuff is coming back. They're not going to let that go. They want to do that. You know, now it's optional, but trust me, when people get relaxed and they're no longer thinking about it, that's when they'll make it mandatory. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.